Hello everybody, my name is Caleb from Caleb the Video Maker and in this video I will be telling you how to automatically have social networks update when you make a new WordPress post. So what you'll need is obviously a WordPress and I'm not going to go into the basics of how to make posts and all that, that's too simple. So um, I expect you to have some knowledge of WordPress but not, not a ton. So what you need to do is um, under uh, plugins, add new, and what we're going to do is we're going to search um, social networks auto. Whoops, I can't even type. Networks auto poster. Search plugins. And this one, next scripts colon social networks auto poster. And you want to install now and click OK. And we are going to be connecting to a Twitter account so our Twitter will automatically update. And what we want to do is activate this plugin. All right, so now we have it updated. It's, I mean, activated, it's right here. And what we want to do is we go to settings. And this stuff can get pretty complicated, so don't freak out. Add new account, add new network, and we are going to go to Twitter. All right, and um, this isn't too hard. Just put your, um, your Twitter URL. By the way, you can follow me at Caleb Curry. <laughs> now, from here, we can put Caleb Curry Twitter, just a nickname for that. Now, what we want to do is we want to go to this link right here, http colon slash slash dev dot twitter dot com forward slash apps. So this is for Twitter developers, and we can sign in here all right once we get to this page there are a few things we want to look at the first is the access level in order for WordPress to be able to write on our account as our Twitter account it has to be access level read and write so we can go to settings and then we can scroll down select read and write and then update this Twitter application's settings. And then we may need to go to details, and you may need to refresh the page in order for this to show up as read and write. All right, so once we have that, there is a few other things we need to look at, and we can take a look at this as a reference. We need the consumer key. So I'm going to highlight that, copy it, and then I am going to paste it. And then we also need the Twitter consumer secret. So we're going to take that, copy it, paste it, and then we need your access token. So what we need to do is we need to create my access token. All right, You're, then it says it's successfully been created and it may take a few mo moments. So you may need to refresh the page Once this is done, you will have more stuff down here. So we copy the access token here. And we paste that in our access token here. Then we take the access token secret, copy, and we paste that here. All right. And then what we can do is we can attach an image to the Twitter post or change the message text format but for now we're just going to click update settings uh, we still have something we haven't done so let's let's look at this we can test our settings by clicking submit and it'll tell us to see our Twitter account so let's open Twitter and we can look at our post test post from free programming tutorials one two three Great, and I don't really want that on there, so I'm going to delete that. Awesome. So then what we can do is we can um, update settings. I didn't really change anything, but oh well. Cool, and now let's try it. We're going to add a new post, publish. All right, our post is published. We can view it. Oh, that's beautiful. And we can check our Twitter account. 
let's go to me and you can see it automatically posted that tweet so that is how you automatically set up tweets from your WordPress account hopefully that was helpful and if you enjoyed it please be sure to subscribe and I will see you in the next video oh yes real quickly everybody before I go you can also add new accounts and let's say you wanted to do one for uh, Facebook well there's always these detailed installation guides that you can find and um, basically this is going to teach you exactly what I just taught you in this video it's pretty simple I just thought I'd show you in video format so yeah basically if you need any type of social network you can just follow those guides and it will tell you how to do it so thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video